The end of 3G cell phone service is almost here. AT&T will phase out its 3G network starting next week, which will impact millions of people with older phones, those home alarms and other services. Our consumer reporter John Matteris has a heads up so that you don't waste your money. People with older phones are rushing out to AT&T stores. Now that the carrier has alerted them, its 3G service starts shutting down February 22nd. I think she has like a flip phone. <laughs> An old flip phone. An old flip phone. But Michelle Jones says for her older mother, it's really no laughing matter. She needs to buy mom a new phone before her lifeline goes dead. They said that they've just eliminated it across the board, the, the, the yeah, 3G or whatever. Verizon and T-Mobile will also end their 3G service, though later this year. It's all part of an FCC plan to free up spectrum for 5G. But Kevin Leary isn't happy, saying many people can't afford an $800 smartphone. I think it's bad. A lot of people can't afford these new phones. You know, they're so expensive nowadays. Now, you might say this is not going to affect me because I have a 4G LTE phone, but it could still impact your family if anyone has a burglar alarm or some sort of senior alert service. Some of the medical alert devices. Dimity Orled of the advocacy group Pro Seniors says it's important to ask your older parents or grandparents about what gadgets they use. We need to get the word out to seniors, but also folks that, you know, family members and friends that can make sure that they're checking if their device is going to still work with uh, the new 5G. The AP meantime warns that 1.5 million families still have 3G home alarms that need to be upgraded. An AT&T spokesman tells us it's helping customers navigate this transition and will provide free replacement phones to a majority of people using older flip phones. The key, though, is to check with your provider as soon as possible so your phone or safety device does not go dark when 3G is shut off. That way you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris.